have as good offense. I guess that can go fly just fine. Come on, you yeah. You flip. There you go. You're crazy. You're flawless down. You're flawless down. Hello everyone, Varkiv here and welcome back to another video. This time we're playing Berserker. Um, quick story, T today was supposed to be a ranked video, but um, I actually saw like hours in matchmaking the last week and I haven't found a game. So that's gonna be a bit tough to <laughs> to produce. Um, so, I, so I just said, okay, fine, let's play a bit of regular duels and here I am. Like I really want to play Berserker, I want to play the minion. So I said this might be okay compromise. <sighs> okay, I don't wanna Like it worked but I, I still hate that I zone up just like too much. I can bury that. Not that one. <laughs> Wow, he buried the heavy. Okay, that's that's surprising. Mm, so he buried the heavy. It means I could have done one more lights. Um, try to bury the neutral lights. Like it's it's. I feel like a lot of times it just comes to the like, same conclusion. I just don't put him in my default gameplay. Like let's say, find out a warlord and, and I notice instantly he has a lot of lights. I don't instantly start burying the lights. And I need to wait like one round to fucking lose, and then I do it. Not even then I do it. Fucking hell I okay, let's let's back dodge. Okay. Oh god damn. Why? 2 0. <laughs> okay, let's try it. Let's try to to think here. Round three. It's, the funniest part is like, I, I'm not getting killed by headbots in that. That's even pro problematic. Mm. I would have been so mad if that didn't kill him. Because I mean, I would have been forced to do a light, and that would have made me OS. So it was basically. I mean, I wouldn't have been forced to do a light. I probably wouldn't have done a light there. But round four. It would have been a shitty situation, that's for sure. Oh, uh, come on, try. Maybe I don't need to parry those service. I don't know why I'm trying to parry those service so much. Where those lights? No, those lights. I don't really want to play. Can you beat those servers? Can I not? All right, zero. It's getting better. Hmm. I mean, what made me take damage in the previous round? What should I avoid? What have I been doing differently? to start winning. 
what has he been doing differently, maybe? Well, I parried him. Okay. Nice. Nice. Good round. Good game, though. <laughs> really good game. Price to parry it. Um, what has he been doing differently this round? I mean, he went back to attacking more with heavies, and he also parried a bit more. And I kind of I kind of fell for the thing that killed me in the first round, which was trying to like actually parry his attacks as well. So that, that was bad. I mean, come on, let's do a match. Maybe we do better. Well, a pre zero can really justify this. <laughs> the loss. Can we? Maybe? Hopefully. Come on. Come on. It's not that hard to crack, is it? It cannot be. <laughs> it cannot be. I'm not sure we can get into this guy's head. So, what is there to keep in mind as well from the last round? Round one. That is kind of hard to deal with right now. But that's fine, I mean, he's using it pretty early, which. Kind of annoying that, like, I mean, I should maybe let more heavies go. God damn. I, I tried something knowing very the light last round, but I guess it didn't work. Ah. <laughs> uh, it's pretty bad. Um. Okay, I mean, I mean, maybe I should act just like a normal human after a fair counter. Instead of trying to light, heavy, make like fucking high read, like, again, high read, uh, high reads are not the best thing to do in this game. Why do I uh, stop doing top, please? I know we won the second round, but goddamn, I keep doing top. Uh, he blocks top. How hard is it to understand? Three times it took. Me. Victory. Fuck. Okay. Uh, <laughs> anything but top from now on. Um. What else? Round three. I'm not sure if, even if I have to break those lights. Like if you think about it. Maybe just blocking. Could be good here. Oh. 
Okay, I mean, feels like that unblockable was just the first 50 50. I, I definitely didn't have to take it. Like, light would have just been safer anyway. Wouldn't have it. Yes, would have, obviously. Um, yeah, committing like that is bad. <laughs> I guess I have to learn from it. Fuck, don't, don't, please! I hate myself every time it happens. Try to get stunned back. And that's it. 3 1. Better, but still bad. Better, but still bad. Ah! We, lo we lost the first game though. I mean, it's improvement for sure, but it's too slow. It really is too slow. I feel like it takes me too many rounds to understand how someone plays. I fucking hate that. <laughs> can I, I can I mean, like to speed up the process more, but I uh, yeah. sometimes I don't know one. One for the road. Come, on, let's do one more. Come on. I mean, okay, fine. This is the for chance to redeem myself. Come on. <laughs> I can do it. I can pre zero. It's only the worst matchup for Berserker, isn't it? Hmm. Guess. Take. Take. Yeah. Like, the, the thing that's bugging me is. You know the Round one. the heavies that are, are thrown out, and, and somehow, I mean, uh, some, somehow, I, I choose to like very or do something about them. And I noticed that it's not profitable for me, but I still do it. Why wow, parried it? What the fuck? Uh, she's so fucking surprised by it. Uh. Wow. On the late bash is like, what is wrong with me? Come on. Okay. Okay, come on. I, I can fucking do it. I can fucking react. Like, I, I just need to get in the mood and focus for it. Like, in, a, in a, even in practice or academy, like, there's a small build up to the point where you can actually start dodging bashes. It's like, I don't know, readjusting every time to how, how fast you should click on a trigger and how, when not to. Like, usually for me, it's different for every person, but some people, you know, they they click too easy, some people they click too fast, I, I click too... Wait, they're too fast, uh, too hard? I click too hard, like, I'm more likely to get hit rather than pre dodge. Somebody worked. I hate that. And we won it 2 0. Come on, one more round and then we can get it. But, um, still. <laughs> Let's try to 
Again, I really want to focus on those headbutts. I, I, fuck it. I really want to react to it. I think I can do it. Just have to focus harder now. Get myself to focus on it. Mm. Great line. Oh, I dodge attack. It's habit, right? Thought it was my move for sure, though. fucking obvious but I, I still was a bit too panicked I guess how did I hit the light so we did oh he parried and then lighted fucking hell I, I, I didn't get a freeze on actually I don't know Have the fucking balls to let it go. Okay. We don't get a happy end we want it. And it's still fine. We want it. Against the worst fucking matchup for Berserker, like a 7 free matchup for Warlord. 7 free means like if you play two players of the same skill. Uh what's it what's it called? And one would play Warlord and one would play Berserker, like out of ten rounds, seven should win Warlord, Warlord should win and Pre Berserker shoot. But it's fine. Whatever. We, we won. <laughs> we won. Alright. I'll see you in the next game. Alright. We have an Orochi. Stylish Orochi. Ah, uh, okay. So I think. Like, this should be pretty clean. This should be 3 0 for sure. So it's fucking Orochi. Like, unless the guy's amazing. I shouldn't really struggle. There's just. It's just about not making mistakes. Like it, it, it really feels like it's when, when you're fighting a character like this. It's about you playing good rather rather than the guy really having it. I mean, obviously, the better he plays, the the better it is. But how much can you really do as an energy? Fuck. I mean, I was pretty close to this round. Don't zone, don't zone. You, you see this, you saw him like punish you harshly for it. So let's learn from that. Um, could have more heavy skill. He only paid once. Still opposite lights as well. Fine train. Good to zero. One more and sh should be really good. Let's just uh, <laughs> keep it this way. He has started soft fainting on local blade to lights. I mean, not soft fainting, fainting. Which can be better, but, but that means I have to make reads. Ah. The 
Okay, so if anything is heavy, I like that. I, I, I. Okay, so sometimes, sometimes lights on. Okay, so I spared last three times, but sometimes lights it. So what is the conclusion? Okay, I tried to fucking faint and fade the light, but I, I got hit out of it. God damn, that sucks. Um. Okay, conclusion is I don't know why I'm missing so much of it trying to make the hybrid when when I faint and wait for it to, to see how it reacts. It's both options. Why well, you said you're not gonna do it, but you still did it. God damn, why am I so bad? Can we won, but this definitely hasn't felt deserved. I mean, really felt kind of a loss, to be honest. Maybe maybe he wants to rematch. Maybe we can do one better. Like I I feel like I understand him better now, but Um I, I still feel like I struggled about attacking. Okay, come on, let's do one more. One more. And this time we're gonna do better. We're gonna do free zero, we're gonna understand the guy. And hopefully get a really good game. I mean, I, I guess one thing I could do is try to play it safer. How do you do that against the OG? Don't have to parry attacks. God damn, I, you don't have to fucking zone. Like, I, I have a problem with zone, actually. I really do. <laughs> I, I need to get it out of my habit. Because um, that it is. Like, if you look at it tactically, it's not profitable. Especially oh, considering what? he waits for it. Doesn't punish other stuff mostly. So. Keep on. You can rest in your It really feels like he doesn't respect from advantage. I mean, it's fine, but... Um... Maybe just... After... After, like, let's say... You're frame positive. Instead of going for a heavy, you could go way more for a light. Assuming that he will light himself and I light first. Because I have him advantage. Or I could just wait more. Like not take not take advantage of it instantly and maybe parry afterwards if he tries to attack again. It feels like a read with this guy every time. Like I cannot let a heavy go without you either parrying or light. Doesn't have to be that way. This is better. Mm, okay, so what is the conclusion then? The, the guy parries or like what? What is there to be done? Like I, uh, one thing that has to be done is definitely not go 50-50 against it. I don't. I want. Don't want to make the high reads. I want to find the smart approach rather than brute force my way into into his defense. So let's see. Oh. Right, you fucking made the same mistake again.
Well, it definitely feels like I'm brute forcing my way in. Like, or... I, I got fucking... Let's say, like, I really wanted to play with it, but... It, it costed me the round, I guess. Ah, uh, how? How do I deal with it? Okay, let's, let's just focus on it. I mean... Fade into light should beat both, right? You just have to buffer it every time. Yeah, I should bet it every time. Fingers wins if it does the light. But overall, I should win. How much should that matter? Mm. Yeah, I mean, I guess just painting the light is the way to go. It's not, it's not the fanciest solution, it's not the best solution, it's... I mean, I know, it is the best solution, but... Like, I wish I could make, like, harder reads. But harder reads usually just involve... Usually result in worse gameplay, like... You have... You have to... Let's say, find a playstyle that can, let's say, can cover multiple possibilities at the same time. Rather than find one thing, of how find high reads that only work in certain scenarios. Because here, here's the thing, most of those scenarios are not gonna work. So, you are stuck in trying to do something that is only super situational. And it might look fancy, it might look like, wow, so, so good, like, look at SC, he predicted so well, but if you think about the fact that so many times the guy didn't predict so well, and the, the, the guy, you just see the part where he did predict so well, and yeah, that, <laughs> that's what I, I think on, on hard reads. Alright, and Ibushi, I mean, Ibushi is like one of the characters that can really style on as Berserker. Like, I, I, I like it, I like it. I think she's great to fight for content. People look for styling. <laughs> Not interesting, actually. Them. Ah, I shouldn't have dodged that. Shouldn't fucking zone. What is my problem? Like, actually, what is my problem? I zone way too much. That, that is my problem. Uh, doesn't throw too many attacks to give me opportunity. So basically, I just have to attack myself and. Been like that. Round two. It's uh, it's a bit sucky. I mean, obviously, if there was like a not a like a more offensive Dubushi, I could really just take advantage of the fact that she doesn't have as good offense. I guess attacking the fight is fine. Come on, yeah. you flip. There you go. Too crazy. Victory. Good flawless round. Good flawless round. <laughs> actually, actually, pretty good flawless round. Mm. I'm not sure like what I can do better now. Like, I'm, maybe I'm a bit obsessed with defects, but <laughs> it's just how it is. You know, can I get it? No, it locked on automatically. Fucking hell. Walks forward. Focus on the kick. You zone. Stop fucking zoning. She's getting annoyed at it. I mean, okay, okay. Like, if you actually want to go like that, sure. 
but I, I think you could have won better than with Hino GB. But that, that, that's fine. I mean, it, it happens. Unlucky. I understand it. Like, Terran is fucked. <laughs> it's okay though. We're zero. Not bad. Not bad, obviously. <laughs> Alright everyone, I think that's it for me today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, a like is always appreciated and I will see you next time. Bye bye!